I appreciate that follow while I'm trying to record this video. But y'all know what time it is. Claude, come on! It feel... <sighs> Doesn't want to play the part. And he just ran all... Oh my god. I butchered that entire opening sequence that I only had one take to do. Oh my god, I gotta fix this suit. Nah, it's got that cat fur on. Maple Story has now officially been in service for 20 years and hoping aside from the anniversary to celebrate 20 years of this game they have a massive massive update prepared hence why it's called New Age first of all and on top of that they have been advertising this update like crazy so first things they've done they rented out the Olympic Handball Park Stadium that might not be the name word for word but we're gonna go with that the Olympic Handball Park of Olympic Stadium and among that stadium there are 14 different theaters I forgot the name of the theater exactly within Korea but there are 14 different theaters it is the same like theater but 14 different locations that they completely rented out for, to show this new age patch uh it used to be six but because there was so much interest for the new age update they got eight eight more locations to showcase it it is absolutely crazy and on top of that they already also closed off the big worlds within the game uh which is something that they normally don't do until after the update goes live for a major update for example savior goes live and the next thing you know bam luna and scania are shut off for new players players that do not have a character in these worlds cannot make a character in these worlds i gotta play a different world instead well they already did that two days ago two days ago so they think this is gonna be massive in this video i'm going to talk about the schedule for the new age showcase my stream right now also when this video is live while it is currently live at like the beginning hours of it i will be live on twitch i'll be showcasing the update in my twitch stream link is down in the description but i'm going to show pretty much what's about to happen in new age so the showcase will begin with a concert uh, we don't know how long the concert is going to be. It's probably going to be approximately an hour, but all of the melodies that they posted on their YouTube channel, they're all officially out. And even one of the full songs is out as well, the song for the heroes. So we're gonna go ahead and take a look at their schedule. So here we are right here, New Age 2023 Summer Showcase. And we are going to be starting off with the song for the adventurers, the explorers, which is actually the melody that they released last. It is the Endless Adventure, and then moving on forward, we have Swear on the Sword for the Cygnus Knights, which will be performed by Viviz. Uh, I'm not really too familiar with Korean groups, but I believe Viviz was not the original author for this song, because this song was initially made for the Ignition update. So, uh, yeah. Next up, we got Crack for Heroes. Uh, they actually released a full song. That is the only song so far, aside from Swear on the Sword, I guess, that we have a full version of. Uh, so you can also check that out on their Korean YouTube channel. It'll be at March for the Resistance characters, which is a performance, meaning this song doesn't really have any lyrics at all. And then there's Born to Be for Novas, which is a really K-pop-ish like sounding song. It sounds very weird. I'm not really sure how to feel about it, but it, it's, it's interesting. And then there's also Zero, um so we have the zero song and then next up we have the kinesis song which is just the kinesis theme which has a new age remix to it so that's gonna sound a little different i suppose and again performance so no lyrics and then we have left aka uh, flora their song is called dawn and then lastly we have anima so it's pretty much going in the order of which these class branches were released we expect this whole thing to maybe take like an hour for the uh, for the concerts and then after the concert is over it's showcase time baby the moment we've all been waiting for it is showcase time 
we don't necessarily know what they're going to show and hopefully it doesn't get leaked like savior did because the savior leak made me really really mad uh they have leaked patches several times and each time i get so upset because it ruins so much of the surprise so i'm seriously seriously hoping they don't leak anything but anyway i'm gonna go and type out my predictions of what i think are like the major things that could be happening in new age so what do i think is happening in the new age patch well first things first i think we're going to be receiving a some type of upgrade system for our characters so upgrade system new new upgrade system beyond fifth job Be beyond fifth job so this can consist of six job uh v matrix expansion again which is still in some more fifth job stuff i guess uh fifth job hyper skills plus passives question mark either way whatever they do i think there's going to be some sort of new upgrade system that we're going to get uh that could very well be either a six job or take six jobs place next i think we're going to get a level 280 area with a new boss because i feel like this update is going to have a lot of power creep a lot of power creep in it so with that is going to have a new boss to match this power creep it's very similar to what they did for the v patch when they added lucid uh so this is what i'm feeling so maybe like another sack symbol so we get one more sack symbol so we have um new sack symbol to make bosses like kalos and uh, Calling more accessible because Saren is already accessible enough with Odium, so we don't really have to include Saren, so that would be nice. This one for me might be a stretch, but I'm gonna put it in anyway. But I think we're going to get a real, not beta mode, but a real 1080p resolution for the game. And on top of that, we get a new UI. This, this might be the biggest reach of them all for me personally, especially, like, yeah, both of these, because I wonder how they would even change it up with, like, a new UI. It would be really, really interesting to see what they might do with that. And then lastly, I believe there might be some sort of, um, like, EXP curve, right? Uh, I think there's going to be an EXP curve up to 275. And on top of that, we get... Let's say a little bit more EXP dailies, which would consist of maybe like new monster park stages. So this is, I think, okay. So what I don't think is Copium is adding Lab and Lehman. But what I do think is Copium is adding a new monster park door for Grandis maps, level 260 plus. It would be nice if they did add Grandis maps like Cernium, Burning Cernium, Hotel Arcs, Odium. That would be super cool and that would give us a lot more EXP as well. And they have been looking for ways to give us more EXP without actually having to grind. So this would be an awesome addition to have for the game. But yeah, no, that's it. Those, those are my main predictions. This, this is what I would like to see. Uh, this is what... These are... The things that I would normally like to see in New Age. I, I hope I am right about some of these. It would be very, very, very nice to have. I think there's going to be way more than what's listed here. But this is just kind of like my little dream list, I suppose. But yeah, that's about it for this quick little video of New Age. Uh, there will be more New Age videos to come after the showcase is over. Uh, again, link is down in the description for the stream the stream will begin for the showcase i'm going to stream again as soon as this video is out but the showcase will start at 2 a.m est it starts at 3 p.m kst which is 2 a.m est 1 a.m cst and 11 p.m pst on june 9th uh, so for PST, the showcase will still start on June 9th, but if you're in pretty much any other time zone, uh, I know PST, so I'll be not like the, the most behind, but you get the idea. Uh, if you're in most other time zones, then the showcase will begin on June 10th. Thank you all so much for watching. I'm ready for tonight to uh, destroy me, but I gotta be prepared. I'll see you guys there.